Hi guys, so are you ready to draw with me today? So today I'm going to draw a flamingo head. So I hope you like it. So I'm going to uh, do it differently today where I'm going to use a color pencil to draw the whole thing without using the Sharpie. So I hope you enjoy this drawing and draw it with me and send me your drawing to my Instagram or Facebook as well. All the information is in the description box below to connect with me through Instagram or Facebook. And I can't wait to see your drawings as well. And I will feature them in my next upcoming video if you send them to me. So I really hope you enjoyed this drawing. I also drew a flamingo a long time ago, like a one whole flamingo not just the head i will put that at the end of this video as well as the i button up top and uh, if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon to get a video every single day because i release a video for you every single day and while we draw i also give you fun facts about what we draw so you can learn as you draw as well So I hope you really like this one because uh, I decided to just draw it with the color pencil so it looks more real uh, compared to having a black outline. And now I will also give you some fun facts about flamingos. Did you know that it, flamingos are the national bird of the Bahamas? Suits very well. And uh, flamingos are very beautiful uh, creatures. If you think the same, comment below and let me know. And if you love flamingos as well, I think they add a lot of color to our world and uh, so beautiful. Um, and if you have any fun facts that you would like to share, please do so in the comments below. I would love to know and share and learn from you as well. And so today's uh, website that I chose was townandcountrymag.com. Uh, like uh, always, I'm just getting the information. I'm not sponsored by them or anything. So going to the fun fact, flamingos means water birds. Uh, so they live uh, in and around lagoons or lakes. Um, and adult flamingo feathers range from light pink to bright red due to their food supply. The brighter the feathers, the more well fed the flamingo is. So depending on the color, you know if they are eating well or not. A flock of flamingos is called a stand or a flamboyance. And um, Don Featherstone of Massachusetts is the inventor of the pink plastic lawn flamingo, which first went on sale in 1958. Uh, if you don't know what I mean, uh, Google it and see. In uh, some houses and like outside, some people have like pink plastic flamingos, just like. Um, it's like a plastic flamingo with a stick sticking out at the bottom. You, you can just um, put them on the ground. So if you haven't seen it, just Google it and they are very, very popular. Um, you can see it if you're driving around, especially in like uh, summery, uh, warm weather places. And the pink tropical bird is a preppy fashion statement that we fully support. Um, I've seen so many prints of flamingos on t-shirts and other things as well. And uh, since it's fitting, I will let you know that I will be putting some products with this flamingo on as well on my Redbubble shop link so you can check them out uh, later. I have the link in the description box below. I have uh, lots of products like t-shirts, books, phone covers, bedding material, shower curtains and all sorts of stuff so you can check it out. Uh, the link is in the description box below for you. 
um, and uh, it's a really big fashion statements and they even have like pendants and like um, jewelry made of flamingos as well because they are a beautiful creature so you can see that it's coming along nicely so you see that I used a little bit of the sharpie for the black areas but uh, I'm going to en enhance it with the black color pencil as well and I'm going to use different shades of uh, pink so mainly I'm going to use Faber-Castell color pencils and if you're interested in good quality art supplies check the description box below as well for uh, affordable good quality art supplies and um, I hope you're adding color with me and have different shades of pink if not one color of pink is also good uh, you can add like grays uh, like a lighter gray color and like shades of like uh, lighter pink and darker pink and even some areas you can add like a little bit of red if you want just to blend it in um, and I'll show you how the full thing comes together and also if you have any requests for me to draw for next time please let me know in the comments below I will draw that for you for next time so let me know in the comments below and if you're liking this video don't forget to hit that like button down below as well So now that we have the beak and the eyes, it's just a matter of adding color and making um, it more and more pink. So I add line by line for the body part because um, they are very furry and feathery. So I wanted to make it look like that. So you can do the same or color it um, with different shades as well if you want. And to give you some more fun facts, um, there are so many flamingo themed products out there uh, even wallpaper and uh, if you didn't know there are six species of flamingos out there um, in the world and there was an old greater flamingo that lived to be 83 years old at the Adelaide Zoo in Australia. The flamingo sadly passed away in 2014. That's sad. And they are very social. They live in colonies of thousands of birds. Even in the zoo they don't have just one flamingo, they have like several of them together. I guess because they love to live in colonies. So now that we have the basic idea of how to color it, I'm going to show you the full color drawing of the flamingo. This is the full color drawing. I really hope you like it and if you do, please don't forget to hit that like button and leave a comment for me and check out the products that I have on my Redbubble link with this flamingo face on. Um, I really hope you love it. Um, flamingos are very uh, interesting fashion statement and very very cute on t-shirts and things so check it out I have lots of products there and now I will put some next videos including the other flamingo that I drew uh, I hope you like that one as well and uh, then other videos as well and don't forget to click on my face logo to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon to get a video every single day because I release a video for you every single day and I hope you have a really really good day and I will see you tomorrow bye